Saw this on the Costco website. It's on sale. This is the Light Sticks by Ben Pack. It's a uh, mostly a vehicle, but any sort of wide area working space uh, LED light. You can see it's got these hooks on the side that are supposed to hook under a uh, hood. 1200 lumens. I uh, read the reviews. People were mixed about the um, time that this would stay on. Maximum is 1200, minimum 650, 36 LEDs, 42 inches wide. Uh, and it says continuous usage up to four and a half hours, but I think most people were getting about an hour with the maximum light. It includes a light bar, 12 volt power adapter, and a cradle frame. Um, the hooks are also adjustable. It does ship in this little, I mean, this is decent cardboard, but uh, some people had received their, their light bar damaged because there's no overbox or any other protection. We'll open it up and look inside. You can see kind of the diagram of how it works overall. So here is how it ships. It's just got a little styrofoam in there. Uh, one thing that's kind of sucky is it's got this, um, these are kind of unique. Sometimes they're interchangeable. These little DC barrel, whatever. And I find that I often forget what these are for because they're like, this one's labeled a WAN G, which is a different label than the light. So I'll put a piece of tape on all of these and label them. That's after uh, the experience of losing them and mislabeling them or not labeling them and forgetting what's for what. So USB charger, different USB-C would have been more ideal than that. But hey, you know, nothing is perfect. A uh, little instruction book. So the light itself separates from this frame. It's just like a little friction or press fitting. These frame ends are adjustable and they're padded so they won't mess up the uh, paint. And I did read a reviewer who was a detailer and he said this was a great tool for his purposes because he could put it inside of the vehicle in between the um, where the doors close and hang this on the vehicle. So uh, it is nice that these are padded. And this is a, uh, feels like steel, could be aluminum. Um, I think one weak point is this plastic, this, I could see this breaking if you dropped it right onto this. It's like a polycarbonate. It's not very thick. I can flex it a little bit with my hand. So if something fell on this, the right angle, um, or you dropped it at the right angle or it fell off, I could see this breaking, although it's not maybe necessary for function. So if you do break it, maybe you can still use it. Um, the low mode has half of the LEDs lit. The high mode goes with both. And one other interesting thing here is it's got magnets. If you're just using this by itself or you can leave it in the um, holder and flip these up and use it magnets. There's also some hooks in here. Uh, but I got to say these are really cheap plastic hooks. And if you left one out and closed it, and I think it's likely that, that these would break because they're just, it's just all chintzy plastic, but they do store away. Um, so I'll test this out and see how strong the magnets are, but you can kind of move these um, handles around and get a, the angle right of how to hang it with whatever you're working on. And I think the batteries, Batteries must be maybe in the handle. Um, there's a charging port on the back of this handle right there. And this is the same part, but this has the charging port plugged. So this is a Ford F-150 Raptor. There's no light that this comes with under the hood. Light. Well, it does fit, takes a little bit of effort to get the uh, tension to the max. Let's try, I have an aluminum body on this pickup, so. Magnet, they're not that strong anyway, but put that in. You can 
turn the light and it's not too shabby and I can barely see right here without the light the camera does maybe a little better job than the eye here but you're still gonna have little shadows and stuff and may have to use a handheld but overall it's uh it's not too bad it's got some different functionality so i think i'm gonna keep this it's on sale right now certainly um it, it probably could be better it still seems a little bit expensive for what you're getting harbor freight also has one that has a bigger battery but it's right around the same price range and of course costco is a little easier to deal with than harbor freight uh as far as returns so yeah it could be a pretty good present you can see there it's maxed out it did take a pretty good elbow grease to get this on there and i wouldn't be able to use the magnets maybe working under the vehicle i could put the magnets on the frame or something they seem somewhat strong i would say light to medium strength magnets for the weight of this um, you could also use the hooks you could hang it vertically one side or try to find some little hanger holes somewhere but anyways thank you everybody for watching let me know if you have any questions 